That's Blue Origin's last test flight of its new Shepard rocket on April 14th, one of 14 successful launches from its West Texas headquarters in the last six years. And touchdown. The next one will carry Jeff Bezos himself, just two weeks after he steps down as the CEO of Amazon. You see the Earth from space, it changes you. Bezos delivered a grand twist in the space race, announcing that he will be on New Shepard's first flight carrying humans into space on July 20th, along with his younger brother, Mark, co-founder of a private equity firm who's always been much more low profile than the richest man in the world. You, Seriously? If you're willing, if you want oh to. God. If all goes to plan, this will make Bezos the first of the space billionaires to travel to the great beyond, beating SpaceX's Elon Musk, though SpaceX has already shuttled plenty of astronauts to the International Space Station, and Virgin Galactic's Richard Branson, who's scheduled to take his first flight to space later this year. The new Shepard will carry the Bezos brothers and the winner of an online auction for an 11-minute flight. At 47 miles above the Earth, the capsule will separate from the rocket. The passengers will float weightlessly for three minutes as the rocket soars another 13 miles to the very edge of space before plunging back to Earth. Oh, look at that smooth landing. There's all sorts of problems um, that we are about to face because for the first time in our civilizational history, going back thousands of years, we're now big compared to the size of the planet. We can fix that problem, but we can fix it in exactly one way by moving out into the solar system. What are the chances the unthinkable could happen? Well, there have in fact been 15 total New Shepard launches. Only the first was considered a partial failure. The booster crash landed, but the capsule landed safely, boosting the chances that on July 20th, Bezos' boyhood dream will safely come true. Emily Chang, Bloomberg, San Francisco.